All right, here we are. We finally got into this. Uh, somehow we got into the sheriff's office. And now we're trying to get out after our boyfriend done got stripped naked of his skin. And then somehow it came back while his gaping wound on his neck is now healed. I don't understand. I have no idea. But most likely he's a monster, vampire, monster, werewolf guy. I just lost at words as you are. Oh man, I'm doing good, buddy. Oh no. How's it going with you, Suru? Ew. Oh, you completed a plague tale. Spoon? Oh. Oh my God! Put you depressed. <laughs> Oh, is it that good, huh? Oh, we got a spoonful of candy. Sis. Ooh, Omnia's brick could be a book of death behind it. Not a chance. What? You think it was moving? I need some sort of lever. <gasps> the spoon. A perfectly placed spoon for the most convenient of times. <laughs> that could work. Oh, yeah, this Can't be as uh, uh, depressing as uh, the Telltale so, uh, uh, games of uh, The Walking Dead. Yes. <laughs> Okay, anything in there? Did she grab something out of there that I didn't see? So it's just a loose brick. Huh. Okay, well. I guess we'll just use this use the brick on him. Clobber. Oh my god, that bad, huh? Watch Damn. it, man. I bruise easily. Uh, Give me a break. I got it on my wish list. On Steam. Hey, the second we get out of here, you're toast, motherfucker. Sure. Second you get out. <laughs> Is that supposed to be? What? What's that supposed to mean? What the fuck is that supposed to mean? <laughs> hey! What the fuck is that supposed to mean, asshole? Hey, you can't oh, just we leave all us know. in here! Hey! Come back! Fuck! Binky Bonky? Did he just say Binky Bonky? Playful, how'd it go? Serious, are you okay? Yeah, we got to okay? serious about this. It's just a foot. It'll just heal. Your, just your Binky Bonky. I meant bonky. the interrogation. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Can't break old Max. Many have tried, many have failed. I'm being serious, Max. He, uh, he just asked a lot of questions, a lot of weirdly specific questions about us and where we were going and why and how I was feeling this morning and I don't know. Nothing I said made him seem any less annoyed. <laughs> he asked how you were feeling? Yeah. And, uh, well, he didn't ask if you? the carpet matches nope. the drapes. Uh. <laughs> Rude. Oh, I, I lowered the graphics down because it was starting to glitch on me. You know what? I ought to check it out. I ought to see if it fixed everything. 
Oh, hey, did you get a look at his name badge? You mean it's not really Detective Dick Whippet? It's Hackett. <laughs> Sheriff Hackett. You think he's related to Chris Hackett? Oh, oh my God, like the though. Chris Hackett? Yeah, try it yeah. Out. Who's the Chris Hackett? As in camp leader, Mr. Hackett of like 50 Hackett's off Quarry, now. remember? Oh, Steam. For the Black Friday so. Man. Last night feels like a lifetime ago. The fuck does that mean, though? You know? Where we set up? Maybe it's some kind of crazy camp counselor kidnapping ring. Well, that's... I tell you what, it I still mean, looks freaking awesome on all the settings on what? low, on medium. It's kind of set up, reflective. It's not acting like a kidnapper. Well, I guess Sheriff Hackett's not exactly acting like a typical kidnapper, but he's not acting like a typical cop either. Well, how do you know how kidnappers act? I'm just trying uh, to get us out of here, cops, and I can't get us out of uh, here until I have some clue of why the fuck we're in here. I don't know. What if we can't make sense of it? What? Well, you we have to. Sometimes <laughs> things just right. don't make sense. Yeah, it was starting what bad then? on this game earlier. We're just stuck in a backwater jail cell for the rest of our lives? Each load screen was like, dang, five minutes. Virgin, this isn't fa forever. No, it's not forever. Never. But I tell you what, look at it. Look at it. It looks great, though. It looks fantastic. Man. This isn't forever, Max. You, you can't just hold us here forever. He didn't seem too convinced of that. You gotta stay positive. You can't think like that. Why not? Might as well just accept it, right? No, fuck that. Think about the rest of the summer, Max. And school? I mean, I've been dreaming about becoming a vet since I was five years old. I'm not gonna let this fleabag fuckface stop me. That's Mr. Fleabag fuckface. We're gonna get out of here. <laughs> I'm gonna study to be a vet, and you're... gonna... um... What? I'm gonna what? I saw the letter, Max. What are you talking about? The rejection letter for college. I found it in your bag. <laughs> you were poking around in my stuff? No. I can't believe you didn't tell me. I, I was yeah, embarrassed. Yeah, man, I loaded scream yesterday. Hey, oh my god, your was Your grades were good and you wrote a great lie. essay? Yeah, apparently not good enough. It was eating me alive so badly. Fuck! Jeez. You've been making Today plans, is... Max. What the fuck? I don't know. What do you want me to say? Well, actually, yesterday I closed down the game and then I uh, opened it back up and then everything was fixed. It's like, psh, should have did that. I should have did that hours ago. I did like an eight hour, eight and a half hour stream. I'm sorry, Max. This so like the first five this hours. Really sucks. Five or six hours. It was. I was hey, it's not the worst that. thing to happen this summer. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have kept it from you. Oh yeah, man. Well, I you mean, you gotta you have it set up anything, just right, right, dude. You gotta yeah. have just the right. Yeah, I do. Things going on, man. And it's not always guaranteed that everything's gonna play all right. You go every single okay, time let's you just press focus live. Focus on getting out of here. You gotta for make now. sure Great. everything's Sign good. Sign me up. <laughs> and a lot we of. We need man, to go over it from the beginning. Dude, I streamed like from the when we left entire home? game. Like from when we ran into the cop. Um, so after we ran into the... Whatever we ran into? Of Rose yeah. on... Uh, uh, Actually, yeah, that's when shit started getting weird. DLC for Resident Evil? The dude acted super weird when we said we almost hit Damn an animal. Game you remember that? Wasn't even playing it was like he already time. knew or something. It's like, wow. Yeah. Yeah. That was the really last sketchy. five minutes of the entire game. What if it's not I, even I a real cop? I figured it out. I had to re... I had to well, close out a, win dirty, a window and open it back up. I mean, I think he's a real cop. It's like, wow. We're in a police station. I mean, yeah, but there's like nobody else around. Yeah, that is concerning. Especially the whole hack it hack it thing. Let's just go with the idea that they're both in on it. 
Okay. Wow. So we're supposed to meet Chris Hackett I mean, at they the are camp, brothers. and instead, there's nobody there, and we get attacked by something, and then the cop shows up. That part's all fuzzy for me. Like, I, I remember the steps and a smell like wet fur and a, a dog collar with the name Ian on it. Ian? Ian. Ian. <laughs> I don't think it was a dog yeah, that attacked man. us. Whatever it was, was big. It's not like, always roses and daisies. Yeah, it really did a number on you. Like, like I'm streaming. surprised you're not more messed up. Like, 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 I vividly remember the thing's teeth ripping into you. What is messed up about that is, Laura, I don't have a scratch on But we're on moving me. on. We're here now. We're Everything's going fantastic. What? Hey. My light, okay, so my streaming light just remember? broke as soon as I started before my stream up lost? today. So we I had to put lost? on a secondary light. <laughs> well, yeah, but before that, I was all like, whoa, look at the moon. It's so big, so cool to see a full moon in the middle of the woods. And you were all like, yeah, no shit, Max. It happens once a month. Yeah, so? Right, so, you know... Full moon. Yeah. Well, Google Stadia got a long what if, ways to go, man. Uh. Okay. No. Stop. I'm just saying, you know, maybe there's a slight chance it was a werewolf. Are you out of your. Goddamn mine? <sighs> Werewolves? Seriously? What the fuck? I was about to say, I was like, did it what, just what, get cut what, off in the so middle? Funny? I said literally the exact same thing. Okay. Do you, you got Damn, anything her better face, any, like, though. Aww. Zombies, aliens, time-hopping Draculas. Oh, she looks just like Nick Cage. Uh, uh, Nick Fury from Marvels. <laughs> from the Marvels. That's literally almost the same exact freaking man. <laughs> Ryan, right? Yeah. You want answers? I've got answers. Interrupt me again. You're no, on your Samuel own. Samuel Jackson, you know. Whatever. You know, get these mud. Would it really be so crazy with all the plane. shit that we've been seeing with Nick, with the thing on the roof? Okay, it would really start to explain a lot of stuff. Dylan. I'm just trying to keep an open mind, okay? This is like your ghost stories. How is this so different from your ghost those, stories? Those are those Oh, you are missed yesterday's stream. Campfire stories. <laughs> like there has to be a rational oh, boy, explanation lost his hand. for everything. For Jeez. all of this. <laughs> okay, you were not talking so rational when you separated my hand from the rest of my body. You told me to. And if it's bite with which your face to cleave limb from torso with great haste. What? Wow. You did the right thing. See? He's got a whole poem about it. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> and this boy lost a hand and There's he's still quirky. There's more this than you think. Just let me finish. Then you can decide for yourself if you believe me or not. I don't care. But I think you should hear all of it. Oh my god. Oh my god, Uncharted just ate you alive, huh? Damn. The next few weeks were long. The cop kept us fed and let us take showers, but aside from that, we barely saw him. Damn, why? Max and I, we talked a lot. As much as we could about what happened that night. It was like trading conspiracy theories. We talked about the cop, the camp, the accident, the woods, the thing in the basement, what happened to Max. We just kept going over it all again and again, and nothing was making sense. All we knew is that we needed to get out of there. Damn. The way they go about it is just all tripped out man you know the cops could did the guy could have done such a different job i can't take this anymore it's not that bad they're probably in the same crap at camp no i can't take being in here anymore oh yeah well that part's pretty tough we've got to do something we've got to get out of here we need a, p a plan we keep saying that but it's been weeks so you yeah, know let me know not, if you have one that even cool guys that's like, well, really not very helpful max you are forgetting something. What? Just that 
ETBT tiny detail that I may or may not be a fucking werewolf, you Laura. Just keep it down. So what? What can we do, really? We run off into the sunset only to be stopped when I turn into a nasty ass monster and kill you and eat you, and then I run off alone into the sunset <clears> with little <throat> bits of you stuck in my teeth. Okay, okay, stop. <laughs> Just one problem at a time. He's so descriptive. Right, we, we don't even know if that's what's really going on, and we won't until we get the hell out of here. Okay. Well, it seems to me that we only have two real options. We can play nice and try to get this guy on our side. What, so he'll or, let us go? Or we try to catch him off guard and make our escape. We gotta escape, curious, what if we get on his good side? Okay, so let's say we get on his good side. What then? Brunch in mimosas every Sunday till he sees the error of his ways? There yeah, you go, being now you're thinking. The dude doesn't have a good side to get on. I mean, he don't even talk to us half the time. I don't know. I think we could crack him. Laura, I think he's just biding his time until he can figure out a way to get rid of us. Permanently. <laughs> yeah, right. I think it was just a try. Definitely. You always got to be optimistic about everything in life. I think we should try. I mean, if he was going to kill us, we'd be dead by now. So what's he waiting for? Look, we just... If this doesn't work, we try to escape. Deal? Yeah. Deal. Or offer him a hand job. I don't know. So... Maybe. Alright, how work. are we supposed to get this guy <laughs> to like us if he won't even talk to us? I don't know. I mean, he's gotta have a weak spot, like something we can use. It's not like we don't have time to figure it out. Yeah. Okay. Oh no, you got plenty of time. <laughs> Three weeks later. <laughs> hey, hey! T Money! Can I call you T Money? <laughs> Why? You can call me Officer Hackett. Hackett? Like, as in. Hackett's quarry? You own this place? What's it to you? Just interested is all. Feel like we hardly know you. Well, let's keep it that way, okay? Oh, come on, Team Money. Lighten up, man. Team Money. No reason we can't be buds, <laughs> right? I can think of seven. We've been awful. You're right. We've been just awful, and we really want to make it up to you. We'll make you a birthday cake. Oh. I see what you're doing. Mother That's not gonna work. You Mother think we're just gonna be besties, and I'm gonna let you walk <laughs> right out of here. Not gonna happen. Asshole! Max! We know what's going on! We know Max is a werewolf! Ooh, got him. Full moon's in a few days, right? What What then? No, ma'am. You don't know the half of it. Won't you dare talk about it? Oh, damn, motherfucker. Why don't you talk about it? I said, take your fucking clothes off. Fuck off! Get back! Holy Max, shit. what's going on? <laughs> Get the fuck away from him! Oh my god, his skin's about to explode. Come here. Get off of me! Shut up. Oh my god, don't make her watch! <laughs> it's so messed up. You had a great spot, you're gonna see what's Quit gonna happen. Foreman. Said you wanna be a vet, right? Call us an internship. <laughs> right? Let me go! You're not gonna believe it until you see it for yourself. Yeah, but still, it doesn't matter. Why are you acting like this? Fucking ask next time, then, dude. Jeez. Don't get too close. This dude just all types Come of messed in. up. What's your position? Over. Shit. Uh, your anus. Over. Mm-hmm. Just wrapping things up here. Now, I said this time and time again. The best, most of the time, about 85%, 90% of the time, you're not going to do anything. Don't call for help. Don't press no buttons. Just let that time run out. 
Heads up. Once in the blue moon, there is that time where you gotta use your better judgment and it's like, mm, okay. Down to 20. Over. What's gonna happen? Well, I'll tell you. It's not gonna be pretty. But don't worry. I'll be back at dawn. You're really gonna leave me here? You'll be fine. Just don't get too close. Why? Why do you, you, you make the most worst decisions in the universe? Officer, I mean, Sheriff Hatchet of Kill County. God, one hell of a name for a county, huh? Yeah, okay. Tell me what you're feeling or compassion. Compassion. Don't worry, Max. I'm here. Yeah. You don't need a doctor right now. Yeah, right. Are you all right? I, uh, I don't know. Watch, I just don't wait feel till so you good. see this. <laughs> um, what do you need? What can I do to help? Oh, it's just hot. Are you hot? Oh, I'm kind of stuck next to this big ass pipe, so I'm not exactly cool. Just stay back, okay? You shouldn't be this close. There's not a lot I can do about that right now. You can cut your hand off and get away. Max? Max? Oh, snap. Tell me what's going on. Oh, they're doing a good this time. Oh. Money shot. Oh, my God. Whoa. He said not to get close. Even though the sheriff is an idiot. I'll be the same way as I damn. Now nah, I ain't got an eye. I like both my eyes. Well, those scars healed pretty quick. You'd think they'll still be gushing with blood. So much for depth perception. It's okay, I know how it feels. My left eye is like almost blind as a bat. Let's see what that bastard cop's hiding. Nope, game time. But first, let's see what's going on over here. Uh, I was kidding. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Scared the shit out of me. <laughs> Can we do that again? No, we're gonna get killed. <laughs> well, we can't die. It's, a, it's past tense. Max! You took my eye, Max! Max! You took my eye! How dare you take my eye! The number good to you. Let's bring this spoon with us just for good, safe measure. Uh, 
Yummy. No, that's not what I want to do. Go to that box. Oh, that's just tons of help. goodies yes it's a little difficult to navigate Ooh. Mm. my blood my sweet sweet blood Then I get my grubby little hand. Oh, nice. The chariot. At the reins of a chariot, we would all feel safer. Taking control, relying on determination, on determination to make our choices. Valiant, but in some cases foolish. Many seek refuge in chariots, but perhaps. In some cases, they're not as safe as we may think they are. What the hell is that? Goddamn bird? this room first okay there's nothing in here okay so first door of Locked. course figures and I guess I can't leave Max better keep snooping or I could go back to my cell and wait I guess Oh, we ain't gonna do that. Let's try these other doors before I... What's he hiding? Um, take a wild guess. Ooh, Snoopy stuff. What are you hiding, Travis? A letter instructing those behind and behind the bizarre yet bona fide podcast to stop investigating Hatch's query. Hmm. That's weird. But I don't want to read it. To bizarre yet bona fide, it has come to my attention that you recently released an episode of your podcast that features the town of Northkill, and more specifically, Hatchet's Quarry. If I am understanding the text correctly, said the episode investigates the mystery of a ghost in the woods. In the woods. So the very idea of this first completely pro pro preposterous, and as I'm sure you're aware, no such thing exists. I am writing to tell you that the Preparators, preparators of Hatch's Quarry has expressed concerns that such unsavory stories have continued to deform, de de detrimental to their various business avenues, including Hatch's Quarry Summer Camp, which prides itself on being safe, fun, environmental, and for children from 
from all over the country. It is this in mind I ask you to take down this episode of your podcast and refrain from rele- releasing any further solic- unsolicited publicity around Hatchet's Quarry. The proprietors of said land would not be against seeking legal action if you do not comply with their request. Please accept this letter for a form- as a formal request with the benefit of both parties in mind. Respectfully yours, Travis. Travis. Hmm. So there's. Oh, okay. Travis is that guy. Fuck. T money. I'm gonna need to rest soon. T money. He should just said T money. Oh, we're not resting yet. Oh, we we rested plenty. Hold him up. Water. Ooh. Four months on high. Ann Radcliffe and Edward Benson. Wonder who they are. That guy. The guy in the water. Cats, dogs, not the cats, not the dogs. Hello? Kill them all. Okay. Lovely operators. Come on now. Not so much a hint as a slap in the face. Get locked out. I need to lie down. Or we can find his birthday. Got that Houdini poster over there too. Last scene, last scene. Okay. Need to find his birthday. Okay, nothing else over here. Nothing in the safe. Maybe that letter says something. I heard nothing, everything's okay. Mama's boy. Fifty six. That means he was born in nineteen sixty five. Oh, 
Got it. Now we can't get back. All right. All right, all right, all right. 1965. I'm a snooper, so I do a lot of snooping. Ooh. Whoever was wearing this can't be doing too well. Charred sheriff's. Ooh. This old sheriff's badge is badly fire damaged. Does it belong to current sheriff or one of his predecessors? Previous sheriff was killed in the fire six years ago, so presumably this belongs to him. Travis must have seated him. I have exhausted this and myself. I need to sleep. No, no, no. We have exhausted nothing. We're gonna find every little thing. All right, nothing else. So we got one more room. How can you be sleepy? You've been locked up in a cell for weeks. July 7th? July 7th, 1965. Absolutely nothing else, huh? All right. Yeah, give me the goodies. Oh, yummy. I this must be what he used to knock me out. I love the nitos. I can hide this in my cell. I won't use it though. July 7th, 1965. Get on that computer. This shit, we gotta shut it down. Can weren't hikers at all, but ghost hunters who went in search of answers and fell victim to the Hold on, where was it? An episode of the Supernatural Investigation Podcast. Exploring the mysteries around the hatches of quarry. The mercy of the hag of Hackett's quarry, never to be seen again. Like us. Except for the fell victim to the mercy of the blah 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 part. We're, we're more like.
like, um, ghost investigators? Spectre sleuths? Sure. So, what happened next? Well, according to reports from the local paper, the North Kill Gazette, some hay bales caught fire during the opening night, and that spread pretty quickly. Before they knew it, the whole place was up in smoke, including the show's leading lady and her alleged baby boy. Baby boy? Is that Ian? I'm gonna have to make me some more coffee. <laughs> the hell was that? That's it? You're not gonna go through anything else? I'm gonna search through all his stuff. Please confirm set up set up a your FP email media player Now we can go to bed. Oh, you know what? Let's try the exit door. You never know. Of course not. Let's go check out our buddy. How you doing, Max? Remember my eye? Oh, I bet you do. I bet you do. You want to tell me what happened? I could ask you the same thing. Why didn't you run? Determined we got unfinished business. I won't leave Max. This doesn't mean I trust you. I don't care. I just want to help him. Turn around, hands against the wall. He admires your dedication. Seriously? I am too tired to argue. But... Ugh. Oh, he's got Me blood too. all over his face. For some reason, I was just now noticing that. Given this game, you know. Well, so you made yourself at home. That's what you used to knock me out with, isn't it? This is dangerous. Could you not have used that on Max last night? Maybe I'd still have two good eyes. Yes? Yes, but it's really fucking hard to do. Yeah, well, it's even harder for me to do now that I only got one eye. What's this? 
an education. Watch. Second one! Nice job cleaning up. The eye. I mean. Oh my god, I barely thought about it. I should have hid the fucking needle behind the brick. No wonder he found it on me so easy, because I'm an idiot. Wow. It's harder than they make out in the textbooks. Especially when nobody's helping you. You're the doctor. That makes me mad. Uh, animal doctor. And no, I'm not. And I probably never will be. Stuck in here forever. Let me go get my charger real quick while they're talking. You know, just cause you know, doesn't mean you know. You know? Uh, yeah, I know. What? I'm not. This isn't what it seems to be. You're gonna have to be more specific. You and Max are in just as much trouble as I am. My family? We didn't mean to hurt anybody. We're just trying to survive like everybody else. Do you understand? Not really. We're going to end this thing once and for all. We? Yeah. Tom by his brother. Okay, hold on. I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. Curious, how is your family involved? So, how is your family involved? They were all right. killed. Is down at the bottom of a well. Holy what? crap. What the... That's not Family the answer I was looking is for. The most important thing in the world. But if your whole family, you know, like every last one of them decided to jump down the bottom of a well and they're all just hanging on the end of a rope, how can one person be expected to pull them all back out? You can't. You just can't. It's impossible. You pull on that rope and you're just going to fall right down to the bottom of the well with the rest of them. It's just impossible. And what's the point of that? Right, so you... You're the one at the top of the well with a rope, and... Yes. I thought that was obvious. Yeah, okay, yeah, I got it. Oh, God, jeez. I'm making my coffee. Let's see how smart you really are. What is this? Information. Ooh. Well, I love information. Read it. When full the moon above shines first, the beast internal shall outward burst. One by one leads lambs to slaughter. It stalks your breath, but shuns clear water. And should you yourself be cursed, armed with silver and the first, when moon is full before its wane, rend the beast that cursed you slain. No longer shall you face your Riddles. blight. 
Or fear the dread of full moon's light. Yeah. Keep reading. No, we're not gonna take the gun. We're not gonna take no damn gun. And if it's a bite with which you're faced, cleave limb from torso with great haste. Perchance you'll save your cursed soul before infection takes its toll. Starting to get the picture. It's not a lot to go on. And frankly, it's shit. Why did they have to make it rhyme? I don't know, but it's all we have to go on. Hmm kill the werewolf that bit you and you'll be cured. It has to be silver. It has to be full moon. Seems pretty straightforward to me. If you can kill the werewolf, and that's a big if. Big if. if I just if, want to cure Max. If. It's not as straightforward as you think. What does that mean? Sorry, I'm going back and forth. I'm grabbing my coffee. Concern. Why didn't you kill it? <clears throat> Am I infected? So wait, if Max got me in the eye, doesn't that mean I'm infected now too? No. Scratches don't do it. Only bites. Oh, that makes sense. Are you sure about that? Pretty sure. Oh, yeah, he's pretty sure. Oh, God, another. Encouraging. What's your plan? So, what's the plan? I'm about to say, what That's from hoping you'll come in. Me? Yeah. Because your studies. I haven't even started. Well, you're the best option I got. Mm. I've been hunting this damn white wolf under the full moon so long I start to think it doesn't exist, you know? Maybe it doesn't matter because maybe there's another way. Whatever you believe, there's gotta be some science. And you do science. Maybe. Look, take some time to think about all this. I'll be back in the morning. Oh, God, don't not. You gonna leave me here alone again? What, you want him to enough. take my other eye? Kimberly, he's gonna leave me there again. How rude. I'm on my way. I don't think I'd believe a word he just said if I hadn't... If I hadn't seen that. Well... I'm not sure... Resign. I believe him. I believe him. I believe him. You can't tell me you really trust that guy now. I didn't say that. I said I believe him about the werewolf stuff, not the science bit. I don't know what he wants. He's a dirty line kidnapping cop, Laura. We should be careful of anything that fucker says. Max is dubious? What the hell? What the hell does dubious mean? Let's find out. Well, fuck him. He's had his chance to fix this. Right. We're getting out of here, and we're going to fix it on our own. Hey, Laura? Yeah? 
hesitating or doubting? I saw what happened. Not to be relied What I did to your eye? Suspect. Suspect. Is it bad? Yeah, it's pretty bad. No, it's okay. It's just missing. I'm so sorry. Yeah, that sheriff was not freaking... Pathetic. Yeah, that wasn't you. It wasn't you. I know it wasn't you. I know. But it was. It fucking was. <laughs> Oh, We're gonna sorry. fix you, Max. You can have my eye. It grows back. Every time I come back from... I promise. He said, let me in there. Chris! I know they're in there. Who? The counselor that didn't show up. How'd you find out? Bobby told me. Said you scrapped an abandoned car. A while back, I, I worked out the rest. Shit. Why? Well, why'd you think, Chris? Jesus, Travis. You're still here? That's fucked up. I fucking bit one of them, Chris. What's I supposed to do? <sighs> what was that? <laughs> Nothing. You shot me. I'm telling Mom. Thank you, Lucky Stars. It wasn't silver. What's your plan? You can't keep them here forever. I am handling it. Maybe if you'd done your job, they wouldn't have been at the camp that night. You ever think of that? If I'd have done my job, you'd all be in prison. You ever think of that? That was all Bobby and <laughs> Caleb. And are you those know hikers? And that, that, that fucking journalist? Damn it, Travis. What are we going to do now? Whatever happened to, we're all in this together. Shh. Go to my office. You shouldn't talk here. No, oh my God, that's crazy. Max. Uh. Max. Ah. Uh. What is it? Travis was just in the hall talking. The cop. So. With Chris Hackett. Was he here to let us out? No. He's the werewolf, Max. Chris Hackett is the one that bit you down on the storm shelter. Ah. Oh. Holy shit, that's... Who would have guessed? I mean, I guess, thinking about it, I could have... And yet you didn't. It all makes sense. That's why Chris's car was at the lodge that night. Travis was protecting him. But that's what's why he with followed Ian? us, and that's why he didn't kill the werewolf in the storm shelter, because it was his fucking brother. God, it's so obvious. If, if Chris was the one that bit me, then... Yeah, then that's our cure. Ooh. That's how we fix you. Jesus, Laura, are we thinking the same thing? Tomorrow we're getting out of here. I'm gonna get Travis's gun and kill Chris Hackett. Damn. Hey! Hey! Stuff just got interesting. Help her! Okay, so we'll go ahead and end it on that good note. Not this stream, but this video appreciate you for being here hit that like button guys hell yeah this is just getting started hell yeah